So we have been seeing so much of Melissa McCall in this season, and I'm loving it. Yep. So it feels only appropriate to have who on as a guest today? Melissa! Bye. Come on out! Yay. Hello! Come join us. Hi, you guys. How are you? Good. Good. How are you? You just filmed a scene, didn't you? I did. I came straight She's off the like, set. Ready for it. These are hot clothes. It's beautiful. Hot set clothes. And you're about to go back and film another, right? That's right. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, well, we won't keep exciting. you too long. We nope. know you have to go create magic. Okay. Thank you. So we have a couple questions. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Okay. First and foremost, how is Melissa dealing with the fact that her son is a werewolf? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I feel like that's kind of a big deal. Yeah. It is. It's a really big deal. <laughs> it was really fun to shoot um, last season. And I think this season it kind of opens up their relationship anymore. Totally. Because yeah. I feel like, um, you know, Mama McCall is a very accepting mom. Which mm. is beautiful. Yes. Which is beautiful. Yes. And I think um, I think we kind of really fell into that hard and fast in the third se mm -hmm. uh, season here. And um, there's some really great stuff between... Um, Tyler and I this year, and I'm really excited. It's about beautiful. It. Yes. Yeah. I love it. I feel it's like really you're a exciting. role model for moms everywhere. Oh, yeah. thank you, honey. It's beautiful. If you, Melissa, yes, if someone in your family, yes. a loved one, said, "Hey, hey, I got something to tell you," I got something to tell you, what would it be? What? I'm a werewolf. You are. <laughs> <laughs> Am I will? <laughs> Spoiler No, nope. too, <laughs> Plot too twist. many rules and yeah, no. no. But if a family member of yours said, "Hey, I got something to tell you," right? I'm a werewolf, right? How would you react? Um, as accepting and as open-hearted as one could be. You mm. would just accept it right off the bat. Just I off would. the bat. Like, I hey, mean, I guess who's I would to be say like... that no one has actually come out of my family saying that they are a werewolf? <laughs> you don't. You don't know. You don't know my life. <laughs> You don't know, know life, life, okay? right? <laughs> We've recently seen you on another little sci-fi series, The Walking Dead. Oh. And we're loving it because <laughs> any more of you that we can get, we love. Yes. But the question Too is, kind. yes. so you have a lot of supernatural beings you have to deal with. Yes. Who do you prefer mm -hmm. to hang out with? Werewolves or zombies? Yes. Which one? <laughs> you have to decide. <laughs> don't just say yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's an easy answer. <laughs> Um, well, they both have their um, positives and negatives. I'll, well, I'll naturally. say that yeah. naturally. Um, but uh, if I if I had to choose, it would have to be werewolves. Okay. It would have to be the show, and I'm not just saying that because I'm sitting between the two. A little biased, <laughs> but okay. <laughs> we want to play a game where we give Tough you some life. situations. Okay. And you have to decide whether you would want to be in that situation with a zombie. Okay. Or mm -hmm. with a werewolf. Okay. Chantel, <laughs> what is the first situation? You just met a guy and you're really into him. Okay. But you find out he's a supernatural creature. Yes. Would you rather him tell you that he's a zombie or a werewolf? A uh, werewolf. Okay. Because mm. I would have to have um, some, you know, intelligent conversation okay. as the okay. rest of our life goes on. You are locked in a bank vault. <laughs> <laughs> would you rather be with a zombie or a werewolf? Uh, a very slow zombie. Okay. Okay. Which makes sense. And I would just kind of go around the wall. <laughs> just, like, just, just an endless and try circle. To, try to survive. <laughs> okay. Like, like, please. That's slow down. <laughs> I like this visual. Is, we this can do you, it. is this how you normally move? <laughs> that, this is my zombie move. Okay. okay. I like it. We're doing it. I like it. You like it. You got to kind of turn yes. it. Okay. <laughs> You're shopping for groceries for your dinner party. Mm -hmm. Would you prefer a zombie or a werewolf helping you shop? <laughs> <laughs> well, um, since I'm not a fan of the uh, red raw meat, well, I guess they both do red raw meat. Yeah. Uh, uh. That's a tough question. That's a tough question. I don't know. Okay, let's go away from the meat. Coin. What about what, like a nice what vegetarian if? meal? Yeah, vegetarian. What about some ice cream? Some ice cream. Yes. I'd like to see or, a zombie or... eat some ice cream. Yeah, right. That would actually be pretty fun. Every time we do one of these episodes, we make sure to wrap it up with giving a little special shout out to somebody special at home who watches. Oh, great. A fantastic fan of the week. This mm -hmm. week's fan is Teen Wolf Daily. <gasps> They're basically, if you haven't checked them out, teenwolfdaily.com. Hi, Teen Wolf Daily. They are the TMZ of the Teen Wolf world. Really? They give yeah. all the gossip, everything like that. So is there anything you want to say to them? I would like to say thank you so much for supporting the show. We really appreciate you and everybody else that tunes in every single week. Um, we wouldn't have a show if it wasn't for you guys. You guys are so dedicated and so loving. And I hope you feel that love um, when we um, put these shows together for you. Because we really think about you mm -hmm. every day. And I'm speaking on behalf of the entire cast when I say that. Um, but I know I do, and I know they do too. That was like so That's tender. so beautiful. That was beautiful. I felt that. I did, did you? Too. Yeah. I meant it. Oh my 
<laughs> okay, well, thank you so much for thank joining you. us on the show. Come with me. I uh, make noises. We can't wait to see what the character gets to do all Me season too. long. Yes. But until then, later, y'all. Bye. Bye.